is First Coast News on your side. First at five, we are following breaking news. Charges are dropped against this Guatemalan teen charged in connection to a St. John's County deputy's death. The deputy died in May of 2023 during a traffic stop and arrest of Virgilio Aguilar Mendez. Our Andrew Badillo is on your side tonight covering this breaking news for us. And Andrew, tell us what you're learning. Jeannie Heather, the state attorney's office dropping charges based on a judge's ruling Aguilar Mendez incompetent to stand trial. Now, in December, experts who interviewed Aguilar Mendez testified saying Aguilar Mendez could not comprehend English and did not understand the severity of the charges he faced. Aguilar Mendez is from a small village in Guatemala and speaks MAM, a Mayan language. In body, lang in body camera video of the incident, Aguilar Mendez says he can't speak English multiple times. Sergeant Michael Kunovich struggled with Aguilar Mendez for several minutes. Shortly after Aguilar Mendez was arrested, Kunovich collapsed and died. The medical examiner's report saying Kunovich died of an irregular heartbeat. Shannon Schott is an attorney not involved in this case and says it would have been a hard one to prosecute. The state was never going to overcome any sort of motion to suppress or potentially even a motion to dismiss based on the posture of the case and based on the facts of the case. And Aguilar Mendez will remain in federal custody due to his immigration status. In a statement to First Coast News, St. John's County Sheriff Robert Hardwick saying he still supports the actions of Sergeant Kunovich the night he died. At 6, we'll have more comment from the sheriff. In studio, Andrew Badillo, First Coast News on your side.